everyone. Welcome back to RTS and welcome back to Spending Freeze Freebie. It is the last day of the month, so it is our time to check in and see how we're doing. So let's do, let's just talk about that right now. How is your spending freeze going? Whatever your spending freeze is for you, it may be simply just cutting back a little bit. It may be simply just getting two kits a month, or you could be going uh, hardcore like me and spending nothing for the entire year. So my check-in for the month of March is that I'm at the uh, last day of the month and I have not spent a single penny on anything scrapbook related. I haven't bought any store-bought cards and uh, what else? I haven't even used any gift cards. So I just absolutely have not been shopping. Absolutely not. Just haven't because I've been busy scrapbooking. I mean, imagine that. <laughs> busy scrapbooking rather than shopping. Yeah, sign me up. So I'm getting a lot done. So uh, let's talk about a couple things we can have for a spending freeze freebie today. And if there is anything that you know that is available for free and when you would like to see it in the spending freeze freebie, by all means, uh, tell me in the comments section and I'll look into it. So I have a couple things that we're going to talk about for something free. And then one thing uh, I want to talk about is also too, as you are working on using your supplies, your inventory, your stash, your anything a little bit more in 2019, perhaps maybe keep track of what you are using. Meaning, as I'm going forward in this spending freeze in 2019, I am absoluting, absolutely writing down what I'm using and how much I'm using of it. So I have an idea because if you would ask me, how many ATG refills do you use in a year? I have no idea. How many Sizzix plates do you go through? I have no idea. Uh, how many blades do I go through? I have no idea. So I'm keeping a track of that. And so here it is the end of March and I have already used five ATG refills. Yes. So I didn't know. I mean, I would think oh, you use one a week, one a month. I simply just didn't know. So it's just being mindful. Even if you're not in a spending freeze, this type of tracking helps you realize sometimes we don't need to maybe buy a whole case of ATG refills. I don't know. Can you ever have too much refill? I don't know. It's kind of like, can you have too much paper? Probably not. But again, also too with blades. Maybe if you're someone only has a pack of blades in reserve, maybe you need more than one pack. Maybe it's three packs. So it's a good thing. Okay. And then also too for my six six plates. I really cannot honestly tell you how long it takes me to wear out a Sizzix plate. So this is interesting. So that's just a little tip, a uh, tip, tit, <laughs> tit, tidbit. Oh my Lord. <laughs> Some of the things that come out of my mouth, but we're going to keep on rolling. Yes. That is a quick little tip. Yes. Okay. So now let's talk about something that I found free last week. I was so excited. Yes. And I don't even know how I came across it. So I can't even give credit because I was bebopping back, back and forth on some YouTube videos. And I don't know. It was in passing. So what I found was something online and it is called Crafts a Beautiful Magazine. Okay. Now I will have the link below. So just look that, look that up. But what I wanted to talk about is that because they definitely have a free downloads, they have free videos, they have free templates. They even have giveaways. I mean, they have all of that going on, which a lot of online magazines do that. But what I was surprised about and what I wanted to share for a spending freeze freebie this month is that a 19 page book they give you for free and it's a free download. And I was like, what? <laughs> yes, I love when companies do this. Okay, so what I did, this is a 19 page uh, free book. Okay, and so what it is, it's about cards, but I don't consider myself a card maker. Okay, but it's not just about cards. It's embellishing and de designs and you can get a lot of tips and ideas. That's my thing. This is like an idea book. Don't look at it as a card book, but if you like cards, this is, um, what do they call it? 20 beginner cards to whip up. And you'll see a pop up. If you go visit this website, you'll see it pop up and it'll say free download. So definitely take advantage of that. And I printed it out and it's 19 pages. So I'm just going to do a quick little flip through. If you want to see what this free, 19 page book is by crafts a beautiful magazine now I want to give a couple tips when you're printing things online okay I printed uh, a few of these if you see these sheets here these right here this is in a 75 let me find another one here on the left 
I scaled it down to 75% and this is what it is and this is the full page so if you scale things down you'll use a little less ink if you wish to do that because it is 19 pages and it is in color so the other option you can do when you're printing things online because this is 19 pages you can absolutely use the draft print on your I wouldn't do black and white because you're not going to get the full effect okay but use the draft option draft D T D R A F T can you tell them on some cold medicine yes draft option when you print and so then it'll print it print out quicker but the ink won't be so saturated so try a couple sheets first with the draft and see if you like that okay that's how I, I print all of these type of um, online books and things like that I print them in draft because otherwise it'll eat up too much ink so that's a little tip okay so this is what this looks like it says five ways with dear Lizzie papers and that's exactly what it is it's dear Lizzie papers I mean, is this not fun? And look at these embellishments. Just see something you wouldn't even think. Just piercing a little hole. Oh, man, I love that. That would be nice for a title on a scrapbook page. So see what I'm saying? Even though these are cards, uh, this is a card, a book. I'm looking at it for uh, ideas for layouts. Yes, peekaboos. And it gives you all these tips. Yes, look at this. Just very, very fun. Now, of course, they have product showcases, too. See, go shopping. We're not doing that. I'm just looking at the free items. Yes, very, very cute. See, they have more ideas. Okay, and then definitely check out their free downloads, their free videos, and then their templates. They even have paper designs on there that you can download. I mean, this really is worth checking out. I was so excited. Look at these. Very, very pretty. See, and I would use this as a color combination for a layout. That's how I would use that. Or look what they did for a photo corner ladies they use ribbon and they added pearls yes sign me up <laughs> absolutely very very fun oh my goodness see I get too excited okay I'm just gonna do a quick flip through so you can see what this PDF is this free book okay even tells you shows you some steps how to make a layer card there's some washi or some border stickers very very cute and so I just wanted to did I print that out twice I think that's twice Oh, well doesn't matter twice as nice yes absolutely okay so then here we go some utterly fantastic cards <laughs> Oh, if you, if you like lawn fawn and those little critters, right there are some ideas. Okay, right there is the block design with the banner strip. Yes, look, there's the L design. Mm -hmm. There's your go-to designs in card form. Absolutely. Okay, and that's just what it looks like. Very, very pretty. I mean, look at these cards. Oh, yeah, see, and this just gives me ideas for layouts. Embellishment. Embellishments. Boy, I'm so sorry. I can't talk today. Okay. And so that's what it looks like. Okay. Again, just ignore the shopping. You already have plenty of supplies that you can make these cards with. Okay. That's what I wanted to show. So maybe it's only about 17 pages. But anyways, what is this? Printing that twice? Yeah, look at that. Very, very nice. Very, very pretty. Oh, yes, absolutely. Okay, so that is that free book by Crafts Beautiful Magazine. The link will be below. Definitely check it out. Something free? This is going to go in with my classes just like everything else. Yes. Okay, so next thing I want to talk about is that my little girl gave me a birthday gift, and she put this birthday gift in this beautiful bag, okay? Now, because of traveling, my bag got a little beat up, but this bag is so pretty that there's no way I can throw it away. And I thought, well, I can't reuse it because, you know, obviously it's banged up. I don't want to re-gift it to somebody else that banged up. But I thought, you know what? Would this gift bag bring forth a lot of embellishments? Yes, it would. Because you look at the tag, I mean, that right in and of itself, and I'm just going to cut that right now. <laughs> yes, I am. Okay, and I'm going to cut this here inside. Okay, so... Uh, reusing right right there is a perfect embellishment and then also too I can cut these and then I can use this beautiful sheer ribbon on a page or a card or a tag okay but I'm just going to I'm not going to show all of this I just want to show something okay so there I have just with a couple quick snips of some scissors I have an embellishment to play with you absolutely cut that in half and that's two embellishments okay and then I have this ribbon okay now this type of ribbon is not my favorite it's like that organza but you know you could straighten it out I could definitely give it uh, a pleat you know and you could definitely play with it so what I'm saying is embellishments ribbon okay and then what I'm going to do is that I am absolutely going to cut down this bag and look at the sides 
Okay, I have this pretty pink, okay? So I probably will use some of my punches and just to punch that design a little bit, but I am absolutely going to cut these flowers out and I'm going to use them on a page showcasing the gifts that she got me for my birthday. I mean, look at that. Look, I mean, and I don't know how much this bag cost her. I'm sure she probably got it at the Dollar Tree. I'll just see. Yes, she did at the Dollar Tree. Okay, so this entire bag, this is a big bag for a dollar. If I was to buy all these embellishments here on the front, because on the back is the exact same thing. Look at that. Is that not beautiful? If I was to buy them, I'd probably have five or six dollars in that. And so I'm absolutely, I'm going to cut out these leaves. I'm going to cut out these flowers and they're going to go in a little sandwich baggie as ephemera. I mean, I just wanted to show that. So look at your gift bags that you're getting this year. Now, is this acid free? No, it's not. But half the things we use nowadays probably are not acid free. So if that's a concern, just skip this. But I just wanted to, I just wanted to bring that forth because sometimes we get so used of the way we do things. I normally, because this is banged up, I probably would have threw this away because I can't reuse it. Okay. But I definitely can reuse it for uh, some scrapbooking because these cards Cards. I mean, look at these leaves. Look at these cards. That's what you're buying in ephemera packs right now. Yes, absolutely. Okay, so that is the Spending Freeze freebie little chit chat for the month of March. A pretty little quick one, but uh, isn't that fun? I mean, look. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. So, you know, and then also, too, even if you are just cutting back, the next time you're in Dollar Tree, you know, these bags are a dollar. Look for the bigger bags because you're going to get more uh, ephemera, more pieces to play with in the bigger bags. And I think this was in a wedding line. And you can get a lot of embellishments just for a dollar. Okay, nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with cutting back. Absolutely. So that way you can still have something fun to play with. I mean, this will be nice. Oh, just can't wait to cut that out. Yes. Okay, and then of course, don't forget to grab this free book of the 20 beginner cards to whip up for some inspiration for the month of March. Yes. And you know, National Scrapbook Day will be coming. We'll need inspiration for that. Yes. So that is all I have for this Spending Freeze freebie for the March edition. Come back at the end of April and you know we're going to have a little chit chat again and if you fell off the wagon no worries because guess what when you wake up tomorrow it all starts all over again <laughs> absolutely give yourself some permission to just say it's all about progress not perfection can I get an amen yes absolutely so that's all I have for today at RTS come back because you never know what we're gonna do bye